Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Do it! Just... Welcome back to the channel, guys. I'm your boy, The Dash and Trader. And today, we're going to show you a video of a DoorDash driver doing the unthinkable. Man, stop playing with me. What? Spitting on a customer's food. <laughs> now, look, before we get into this video, I want to express something. It is highly, highly, highly unacceptable behavior on part of the DoorDash driver. Really, nigga? And we need to not only shun this behavior, but shed awareness. Do it! Just! We need to let DoorDash know that this is unacceptable and somebody needs to be held accountable. So without further ado, we finna get right into this video. Sets the order down, take the picture, and then after he take the picture, he don't walk away. That's the first red flag right there. Once they need to take the picture, walk away. You shouldn't be there anymore after that, after you take that picture. So he takes the picture and he stands there for a second. Now he say they didn't get a tip, so they don't get nothing. Did you bend down and spit on the food? Are you kidding me? Bro, that is crazy. Run that back. I cannot believe that in 2023, we got folks that think they can do things like this and you're not going to be caught on camera. If I'm getting food delivery, you better believe I got a ring camera. Now, I know everybody don't got one, but you should just go ahead and assume that at all point of time, you are on camera in 2023, especially when you're in the United States. I'm not sure if this driver was you know, from a different country or he was an immigrant of some sort, That's that. none of that matters. The only thing that matters is the the health and safety concerns and uh, how is DoorDash letting something like this happen? Who spoke with the 13 year old boy whose name will not be mentioned right here on this channel, who placed the order as well as the child's mother. Now they said they paid about $30 for the food and they also added a $3 tip. Now I don't know what the distance was, who the merchant was or what they ordered. But the fact that they even left a tip should have been an indicator that this is not a situation where we have a no tip customer. And even if it was, that still does not give you the right to ever do anything like that. He goes on to say they believe the man was unhappy about the amount of the tip that he received resulting in his bad behavior. Well, I don't care if you was unhappy. You never spit on a customer's food, kick a customer's food. You never do anything to a customer's food when you out doing delivery. What is wrong with you? Like these are the things that really make DoorDash drivers look really, really bad. I think that it's definitely DoorDash's responsibility and not only them, but all delivery platforms to ensure the safety and integrity of the food orders. Now we know some things are gonna happen that's out of their control, I get that. But when it comes to something like this, they need to be all hands on deck, pulling that footage back, figuring out who's who, getting the police involved if you need to, because what if that man got some type of disease? Now he didn't spit on these people food, contaminated the bag, no telling what else can happen. Somebody got to be held accountable. Now if this was me and I found out the door that should spit on my food, you better believe I'm about to find out who you is, where you came from, and we got to see what the heck going on because this is unacceptable, guys. In the comments, people is going crazy, as they should. You know, they, they outraged over this dasher thinking that he was going to do this and get away with it. And regardless of the fact, guys, I, I just can't express how upset it makes me when I see videos like this because it's one thing to see a dasher doing something that's dumb or, you know, an inexperienced dash of doing something they didn't understand, but to see somebody blatantly destroy, contaminate, and risk the public health and safety of not only the customer, but anybody else that may be in there, that's unacceptable. We can't have this. So ramifications, we got to figure out who this guy is because this ain't cool. Then we talked about the health implications. If anything, we should use this as an example. If you ever thinking about doing something crazy with the customer's food or they order or they delivery, you better think twice because it's always a camera somewhere and it's always going to be somebody watching you. So you don't want to uh, put yourself in a position where you're going to spend a, uh, a lot of time in jail and also put somebody else in a position where you're risking their health and their safety all because you're mad about an order that you accepted. It, it makes no sense. So DoorDash... They had an initial response to the incident. They haven't taken full responsibility, and we know what they do. They say they then suspended the driver. They conducted the investigation. All the meanwhile, this driver may still be out there doing delivery, spitting on people's food. So this is 
highly, highly unacceptable. The, the importance of reporting on this type of incident, because this is destruction of food and food tampering. If people that's out there doing that think they can continually get away with it, they got another thing coming because when I see this, this is what really makes me mad right here. And this, like I said, imagine if that was your mom or your dad or your son or your daughter or somebody in your family and you find out it's some ring footage out there of somebody spitting on their food, regardless of how much they tip or even if they didn't tip at all, how would you feel? Let me know in the comments below because y'all already know me. I don't play no games. As a DoorDash driver, I take high offense to something like this. And we are gonna leave it at that, but look, y'all let me know what y'all think about it. I got my kids hollering at me in the background. I'll catch y'all in the next one.